please subscribe mad.com and don't forget to hit the bell icon for new video notification Today we are going to find the point that divides the given line segment into 3/5 fi ratio that is 3 ratio 5 as the given line segment we have divide as we have divided the given line segment into five parts like if i write he here the this is 1 this is 2 this is 3 this is 4 and this is 5 So these are the five parts of the line segment with the given end points, and we have to find the point that is three fifth of the way along the line segment. Now three fifth of the way that in which we have two point point uh, we have to find the point that divides the line into three ratio two. Three fifth means three parts on one side and two parts on one side, and fifth means total parts are five. So we have to find the point like if I label here this one, C. X, Y. This point is three fifth of the way along AB because we have three parts on one side and two parts on the other side, and it divides the line se segment into three fifth of the part at, as the total parts are five of this line segment. So let's start with the formula that is given uh, that we have to use. We have also discussed in our previous lecture that which formula we will use uh, when we are given with such questions. So the formula here will be I write here again x is equals to k1 x2 plus k2 x1 divided by k1 plus k2. This is for the x coordinate. Then we have the y1 y coordinate. For that we have to use the formula k1 y2 plus k2 y1 divided by k1 plus. Now let's see what is given. We are given with the what is k1 and k2. Let's see as we have seen that. C has divided the line segment into three fifth part. It means three fifth part. It means it has divided the line segment into three ratio two, as we have three parts on one side of this point and two parts on the other side of this point. So this will be the ratio, and in this case, this will be k one and this will be k two. So we have to use this k one and k two, and what will be x one and x two? I label it as well for your convenience. This will be x1 and this will be y1. This will be x2 and this will be y2. So we have got all the well, uh, all the unknowns that are given in the formula uh, from the uh, diagram that we have drawn. So let's put these value and find the point C with the uh, the coordinates of the point C. So x is equals to first we will find the x coordinate. K1 is three and K1 x2 x2 is five plus K2 is Two and x one is minus five divided by divided by k one plus k two three plus two. What we will get is fifteen minus ten divided by five. Five divided by five it will be equals to one. Then we will find the y coordinate. For y coordinate we have to use the formula as k one is three. What is y two? Y two is three plus what is k two? K two is two and what is y one? It is eight. Divided by three plus two equals to nine plus eight two zero sixteen divided by five sixteen plus nine is twenty five twenty five divided by five equals to five. So we have got the coordinates as c x is one and y is five. So this is how you can find the coordinates of the points. A point that is given three fifth of the way along the line se segment, and you are just given with the end points, or that is A and B of that line segment. So that's all from today's lecture. Thank you.